Welcome back to, Learn with Shiv. Today, we're diving into a very important topic from Class 12 Biology, Reproductive Health. Now before you scroll away, don't worry, we'll keep it clear, simple, and even a little fun. So grab your notebook and let's get started. According to WHO, reproductive health meant a total well-being in all aspects reproduction, that is physical, emotional, behavioral and social well-being. Family planning program were initiated by government in 1951 to develop a reproductive health note. 1. Saheli A new oral contraceptive for the female 2. Saheli was developed by scientists at Central Drug Institute at Lucknow Saheli Properties. 1. It is a non-steroidal preparation. 2. It is a, once a week, pill with very few side effect and high contraceptive value characteristics of the ideal contraceptive. 1. Contraceptive should be user-friendly easily available, effective and reversible with no or least side effect 2. It should not interfere during the sexual drive contraceptive method. 1. Natural method. A. Periodic abstinence couples avoid or abstain from coitus from day 10 to 17 of the menstrual cycle it is called fertile period. B. Withdraw or coitus interruptus male partner withdraws before ejaculation. C. Lactational amenorrhea, absence of menstruation. This method is based on the fact that ovulation and therefore the cycle do not occur during the period of intense lactation following parturition. Therefore, as long as the mother breast feeds the child fully, chances of conception are almost nil. 2. Barrier methods In this method, ovum and sperms are prevented from physically meeting with the help of barriers such as a condoms available for both males and females e.g. Nerode. Prevents from unwanted pregnancy and also STIs and AIDS. No side effect B, diaphragms, cervical caps and collie are inserted into the female reproductive tract to cover the cervix during coitus. They are reusable, C, spermicidal creams, jellies foams are usually used along with these barriers. 3. Intrauterine devices, X non-medicated lipper look copper releasing CUT. CU7, multiload 375 hormone releasing progestaser, LNG20 function. 1. Increase phagocytosis of sperm within the uterus and CU ions released suppress sperm motility and the fertilizing capacity of sperms. 2. The hormone releasing S equals also more the uterus unsuitable for implantation and the cervix hostile to the sperms. 4. Oral pills it contains progestogens or progestogen estrogen combinations. 2. Pills have to been taken daily for a period of 21 days starting preferably within the first 5 days of menstrual cycle. Function. They inhibit ovulation and implantation as well as after the quality of cervical mucus to prevent entry of sperms. 5. Injections or implants right pointing arrow 1. Progestogens alone or in combination with estrogen can also be used by females under the skin. 2. Administration of progestogens or progestogen-estrogen combination or IUDs within 72 hours coitus hake been found to be very effective as emergency contraceptives as they could be used to avoid possible pregnancy due to rape or casual unprotected intercourse. 6. Surgical methods or sterilization used as a terminal methods to prevent any more pregnancies. It blocks gamete transport and thereby prevent conception. A. Vasectomy, for male. A small part of the vas deferens is removed or tied up through a small incision on the scrotum. B. Tubectomy for female equals a small port of fallopian tube equals removed or tied up through a small incision in the abdomen. Their techniques are highly effective but their reversibility is very poor. Side effect of contraceptives. 1. Nausea 2. Abdominal pain 3. Breakthrough bleeding 4. Irregular menstrual bleeding 5. Breast cancer MTP. 1 intentional or voluntary termination of pregnancy before full term is called mtp or induced abortion 2 government of india legalized mtp in 1971 with some strict conditions to avoid its misuse such restrictions are important to check indiscriminate and illegal female fetuses why mtp i to get rid of unwanted pregnancies too if continuation of pregnancy could be harmful or even fatal either to the mother or to the fetus or both Sexually transmitted infections, STIs, diseases which are transmitted through sexual intercourse called STI or venereal disease, VD, e.g. gonorrhea, syphilis, bacteria, genital warts, genital herpes, HIV, AIDS, hepatitis B, trichomonosis, CH lamidiasis, protozoa hepatitis B and HIV can also be with transmitted 
by sharing of injection needles, surgical instruments, etc. Except for hepatitis B, genital herpes and HIV. Other diseases are completely curable. Early symptoms are itching, fluid discharge, slight pain, swelling in the genital region and complications if it is not immediately treated. It may lead to complication like 1. Pelvic inflammatory diseases, PID, 2. Abortions, 3. Stillbirth 4, ectopic pregnancy 5, infertility or even cancer of the reproductive tract. It is high among persons in the age group of 15-24 years. Preventive measures. 1. Avoid sex with unknown partners, multiple partners. 2. Always try to use condoms during. Coitus. 3. In case of doubt, one should go to a qualified doctor for early detection and get complete treatment if diagnosed with infection. Infertility. Assisted reproductive technologies, in vitro fertilization fertilization outside the body in almost similar conditions as that in the body followed by embryo transfer. Also known as test tube baby program, ova from the wife donor female and sperms from husband, donor. Male are collected and are induced to form zygote under stimulated condition embryo formed by vivo fertilization, fusion of gametes within the females, also could be used for such transfer to assist those females who cannot conceive. Gift, gamete intrafallopian transfer, transfer of an ovum from an ovum collected from a donor into the fallopian tube into the another female who cannot produce one but can provide suitable environment for fertilization and further development. Zift, zygote intrafertilization. Zift stands for zygote intrafallopian transfer. It is a technique used to treat infertility where the zygote formed in the laboratory is transferred into the fallopian tube. This process is part of assisted reproductive technology, art. In Zift, the zygote is transferred into the fallopian tube at the 8 blastomeres stage. Unlike IVF, where the embryo is transferred into the uterus, Zift involves transferring the zygote into the fallopian tube. This technique is used when there is a need to bypass certain infertility issues. Intracytoplasmic sperm injection. In this method a sperm is directly injected to the ovum to form embryo in the laboratory. Artificial insemination is a method used in reproduction where the semen is collected either from the husband or a healthy donor and is artificially introduced into the vagina or into the uterus of the female. This technique is also referred to as intrauterine insemination IUI. The process involves the artificial introduction of sperms of a healthy donor into the vagina. It is one of the methods of assisted reproductive technology. Alright. Let's quickly recap what we learned. Checkmark reproductive health equals physical plus mental plus social well-being. Checkmark India's programs promote awareness and family planning. Checkmark contraceptive methods help prevent pregnancy and STIs. Checkmark art helps with infertility. Checkmark awareness equals the key to a healthy reproductive life. If you found this helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to learn with Shiv. And if you have any questions, drop them in the comments below. We love hearing from you.